Hello and welcome to a little dialogue. Yeah, you might hear me talk a lot about dialogue and I don't use the word discussion, I don't use the word debate because it doesn't resonate. And actually I have nothing to debate and nothing to discuss. I have nothing to influence. By definition, discussion is about convincing a group of the best option. I don't know the best option. And it's not the same for everyone. I appreciate in a group, in a team, sometimes we need to find the best for all. But it's not about convincing for me. In dialogue, Bakhtin and many other beautiful philosophers about dialogue, they talk about a space where you have an amazing resonance, where naturally you just click together. You just find that point where everybody is really naturally one, where we find ideals that resonate with everyone. So in dialogue, we make space for different ideas first and different opinions. We don't discriminate, we don't judge, we don't try to be right. We just share from the heart. And so naturally it flows. Bakhtin calls that moment, what I call resonance and click, he calls that aesthetic moment. It's interesting that word. Aesthetics obviously is something beautiful. And the moment is our presence. So in dialogue, it's important to be present more than just listening, being present to each other, to explore, to really hear, to understand, to be compassionate, to fly together, to learn together and to really step away from any form of discrimination. There is no better voice or worse voice. There is no right or wrong in dialogue. Of course, dialogue goes way back to Socrates and Plato. And maybe sometimes it's good to remember those old guys. They had an amazing truth that Maybe it's time for us to discover again a truth, a freedom that sometimes we forgot. We are so focused on achieving our goals, being successful, reaching to a certain point. We have been so conditioned and domesticated into discussing and influencing, into debates about what is right or wrong. But maybe it's not about that. And maybe it can be different. Maybe we can flow even when we are not in the same space. In philosophy, we also have dialectics, something I really, really love. That flow between opposites, not to distinguish between right and wrong, but to appreciate the movement between opposites. Most of all, for me, these dialectics, these opposites, they are really more about exploring and also about staying in the heart. It's not about, again, an opposite is not about right or wrong. It's simply about 
having different views. How beautiful to have different views. How much can we learn from having different views? So here is my thing with dialogue. So forgive me if I don't join your discussion or your debate. As I identify less with this man, with this persona, as I identify less to the labels that have been given to me over quite some time on this planet, I get even more passionate about dialogue. How exciting to listen. How exciting to make space for presence, for an aesthetic moment in time, often unexpected and spontaneous. And sometimes it's that bird that sings with me. It's that hummingbird that makes itself known through its fluttering. It's that tree that shows me its presence. I'm in dialogue with nature. Just now a beautiful yellow bird came to sit quite close. I don't need to touch it. it. Doesn't have to become my pet. I appreciate that moment of connection. Nothing to change. Nothing to chase. Nothing to seek just being here. So from my hammock, I'm wishing you a beautiful day, a beautiful evening, a beautiful morning, wherever you are. Just sharing a bit of love from my magic to yours, into your world. Remember, not everything is what it seems to be. But we can see beyond and just enjoy the presence of being here. So let me share a little flute with you to take you into the mood of an aesthetic moment, of a resonance click that just happens when you are conscious and present. I hope you're enjoying with me. I hope you heard the birds that joined in into this beautiful aesthetic moment. That resonance click just to be one without reason, just being here. So see you more for more dialogue from Patrick's presence, often from the hammock, but from everywhere.
hope you heard the birds talking to you and me, creating another moment of dialogue. Also in harmonic resonance. Thank you for being still with me. Thank you for sharing these moments with me in dialogue. See you soon. Love to hear how it reaches your world. Much love.